but Christine and I are at Field, which is a national church camp. It is located in Indiana, and the year is 2014. We just found out we are moving on to the next round, so we have a chance to make it to the finals and to win it all. Alright guys, this is our moment. We have had our ups and downs, but now it's time to bring our A game. We've made it to the semifinals, that's huge. We have a chance to win it all and show them Minnesota is a force to be reckoned with. I have some hints I have learned over the past years I have quizzed. I'm sure every one of you are feeling anxious and nervous. Just try to relax by taking some deep breaths. That can help calm you down. When you are the first one to jump, step up to the mic and repeat the question. By repeating the question, it can help you understand it and gives you more time to answer it. Most importantly, have fun. Remember when we're back at home studying, we're putting memory verses into songs to help us remember them? And look where that got us. I'm not sure everyone, well, every one of us has quiz once before, but I don't know if all of us had a goal last year. This year, I hope every one of you came with at least one goal, and I want us to accomplish it here today. No matter what. No matter what happens in the next few matches, I just want to let you know I'm proud of every one of you. I know our friends and family are cheering and supporting us. Rather, if they're here with us or if they're back at home watching it over the internet. They are proud of us and we do not want to let them down. By, by studying, by Bible quizzing, not only are you keeping God's word in your heart, but you're also building a strong relationship with God. I'm sure he has a huge grin on his face right now, looking down at you, because you have given up your time to study his words. I wanted to tell you that because you deserve to know. You have to have confidence in yourself to be able to perform at your best. It doesn't matter how long you have quizzed for. It just matters how hard you have worked to get to this point. By studying the scriptures, it's already made you a better person. Just remember, keep your feet planted on the ground and get your butt off that chair. Doing so can help achieve your goal. Have fun, and I'm proud of every one of you guys. So let's go out there and Bible quiz it up. Put your hands in. Missile lightning on three. One, two, three. Missile lightning!